Hey, what's going on, guys? Video number two for me today, and I did not even expect that it was going to happen. I got a text a little, little what, about a half hour ago or so? Maybe a little, little more? I'm done. I'm, you're done? From Woody. I'm done. You're done with what? You're done with work? You're done with Carla? You're done with Neppy? You're done with the truck? You're done with what? I'm done with the chopper. So I can finally do my final video on uh, the great, just great buddy build with Woody. Also known as the finish it up in February group build. Here's to you, you little bastard. Ah, I'm just busting him. Woody knows I'm just busting him. Woody's a good guy. Him and Kyle are good people. Um, yeah, one of these days we're definitely going to meet, that's for sure. I, d I built this. Um, not a lot of... There wasn't really a lot of issues with it. Um, the only thing I had a problem with was the gun, How this bottom gun here. Um, it really doesn't have any... How do I want to say this? It really just like fits in there snugly. There's nothing to hold it. Um, so if you don't glue it, it will fall out. It's it's supposed to be able to turn. I mean, the the gun goes up and down, but it it doesn't traverse. Ooh, good word, huh? It elevates, but it doesn't traverse. Um, top rotor works. Back rotor works. Um, this rear flap goes up and down. Um, so it come up pretty good. We'll read you a little history. If I can see it with my glasses. Uh, the AH-64A Apache was developed by Hughes Helicopters Incorporated to capitalize on attack helicopter experience gained during the Vietnam War. The Apache is a twin-engine helicopter with four-bladed main and trail rotors and three-point landing gear. It is powered by two 1600 power, 1600 horsepower General Electric T700 turboshaft engines, which give it a speed of nearly 200 miles per hour. The primary weapon of the AH-64A is the laser-guided Hellfire anti-tank missile, 16 of which can be carried on four pylons. Suppressive firepower is provided by parted 2.75-inch rockets and a 30-millimeter used chain gun automatic cannon. A Martin Marietta target acquisition and designation site and pilot night vision sensor are located in the nose of the helicopter. And I'll show you those when we get out there. They are provided with helmet-mounted sighting systems which allow them to acquire targets merely by moving their heads. And if you guys have ever seen this, these guys have helmets and these helicopters, and all they have to do is look what they want to fire at, and that's where that gun goes. So, <laughs> it don't get no cooler than that. So, yep, she's all painted, all uh, drab. I did it, um, were there two versions or oh, one version? I think there was just one version, though, to be honest with you. It was basically just this, just, just this one version here. So, let's go take a look. Finally, we can go take a look. Good Lord. It seems like it, it seems like that we started this last year. Why does it seem that long? <laughs> Here's to you, you little bastard. All right, guys, let me shut this off. Alright, let's go take a look. Let's go take a look. Hang on. Hang on. Up, up. What are you doing? Hey. What are you doing? Uh-oh. 
What, what are we eating now? You eating a bug? Oh, God. Don't be eating any bugs, please. What? Look at that pretty face. Look at that pretty face. Oh, say hi, Jeff. Say hi, Jeff. Oh, Jesus. All right, guys. Sorry, I got sidetracked. All right, here we go. The AH-64H Apache helicopter. There she is right there. Yeah, this is uh, not a bad kit. Um, this glass fitting off. This is all glass here. This whole side, this top side, and this. This is it's all glass. Um, so you gotta watch how you put it together. Had a little uh, problem with uh, the um, dull coat I put on it. Uh, I had a reaction somehow. I don't know if it was the humidity, uh, uh, what it was, but uh, all in all, I'm happy with it. Like I said, that moves. The big one moves. I, I can get the gun to go. Gonna go up and down. And like I said, I don't like the way that 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 just you, you kind of just like shove that in there. Oh, I forgot to take the tape off the off of that little piece of glass. Hang on, hang on, huh, hang on. All right, so uh, yeah, I just cut that little piece off. Hang on. Yeah, so there it is. Um, yeah, like I said, you, that kind of thing, you, you just kind of like shove that thing in there. Let me put this down and I'll show you the, the front, the, the front nose here. Um, a little bit of work on this. That got painted, uh, clear orange. Um, everything up here does move. Yeah, I know you can't see with my fat fingers in the way, right? This goes back and forth, and then up and down. Um, that's got a little bit of uh, titanium blue, um, a little bit of white. But uh, yeah, we we dress that up a little bit. They don't tell you to do anything in the kit, uh, but yeah, I built a couple of these. They're pretty cool. Little Molotov behind these uh, these side lights here. Little Molotov, but all in all, I'm happy with it. I can finally get it done, get it out of here. So uh, the uh, Mad Mac build is done. When Joe says go, I'm ready to. Uh, I'm all set. So I will be working on the ship and uh, the Doug Hensley uh, appreciation build. So. All right, boys. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you think. Peace out.